Maybe card tricks some other time when... Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. Server's down again. What else is new? Chickenpox, time of death, yada, yada, yada. Aha! Positive attributes. Volunteer time, reading stories to dying children. That's good. That's really good. I think you're Ed Mercedes Colomar. I think you're the one for me. Gladys, are you loco? What got into you? That was a company car. Oh, yeah! And it's even better company now. I'm in. Buenos dias. You're not the nurse? No. 
You're not here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? No, but there's still a chance you could save me. That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calaveda. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche. I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. The only implication here is that I'm fired. Is it something I did? Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? Sure. Where is it? It's wherever you guys put my skin. Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering I've told you nothing. Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. Never killed anybody? I have to confess, I never killed anybody. Not even a teensy bit of killing? Maybe I just wasn't trying hard enough. Were you a big shoplifter? Well, they accused me of it once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. Oh. Mean to animals? Oh, no. I love animals. Once, when I was volunteering at an animal shelter, I... Just stop right there. Ever cheated on your taxes? I've never paid taxes in my life. Aha. Uh -huh. I've never made enough money to be taxed. You know, it's mostly been all volunteer work. Uh-huh. Ever cheated on your husband? Mr. Calavera, there's no ring on my finger. There's no skin on it either. I guess you'll just have to trust me then. Litter? Oh, Manny, is that the best you can do? Work with me, Meche. Give me some dirt. Well, I could do something bad right now, if that would help. Wouldn't count. Sorry, I give up. Don't say that, Manny. Excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble, but please, call me Manny. I'm still on the case, Mitchie, but I haven't found anything for you yet. Maybe I'm not the woman you were hoping for. I just don't understand it. Why can't I find anything good for Mitchie? I'm sorry I let you down, Manny. Domino's door is locked. Hey, funny bones! In my office! Now! You vandalized company property in order to obtain secret information so you could take your illegally modified company car and your unregistered driver and run Domino here off the road! All in order to steal a client from her legitimate agent! There's nothing legitimate about this place. You give all the good clients to Domino. Manny, now I'm embarrassed for you. You've embarrassed the whole office. I'm going to call the woman in here so you can apologize to her yourself. Ava, send in Ms. Colomar, please. She left about 15 minutes ago, sir. She said she had a long walk ahead of her and she wanted to get started. Walking? She had a ticket on the number nine. Why does she think she has to walk? That's the best package I could find for her. <laughs> now you see why I give all the good clients to Domino. That woman was a saint and a shoe in for a double end ticket that she's not going to get because you just couldn't find it. And now, because of your little stunt, she's out there, on her own, walking by herself through the petrified forest, facing the demons of the underworld, alone and unprotected. This is her reward after a lifetime of hardship and public service? Her destiny stolen by some overreaching salesman looking for a fat commission he didn't deserve. Get in there and stay put until the boys downtown tell us what they want done with you. Someone's gonna take the fall for this, Calavera, and it ain't gonna be me! Ooh, ick. It came out like soft-serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. That's not on fire. That's not on fire. That's not on fire. 
Doesn't open. Doesn't open. Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream. Deck of cards just wouldn't help there. Deck of it looks like it dispenses something called philodent. It stays here. It stays here. Not picking that up. It stays here. That wouldn't be a very good... That wouldn't be a very good use of this. Hey! Is anybody out there? So, Manuel, have you thought about what you have done? Who's out there? I'm you. Or rather, I was you years ago. Yeah, well, I'm me now, so get lost. Get me out of here. The only way out, Manuel, is to be taken back in. If you are truly still loyal to this company, declare it loudly. The management might hear and stick you right back in their fold. My loyalty is still to the DOD, believe it or not. Hmm. Good boy. You just keep up that spirit, and I'm sure you'll get out of here soon enough. Hey, guard! How's my little Count of Monte Cristo? No, really. Who are you? I'm a fellow prisoner, my friend. Maybe, but your cell's a lot bigger than mine, jailmate. I'm thinking about getting out and getting even. That's it. If you are still loyal, lay down and roll over and bark the company fight song. I know. Look, I did what I had to do. So what? You have to try harder than that, Manuel. A man's loyalties decide his destiny. The DOD runs a crooked game. And I intend to prove it. You would do that? That could cause this agency a lot of trouble. I'm gonna blow the lid off this place. Young man, you are an enemy of the Department of Death. Welcome to the club. Salvador Limones and guest. Where are you taking me? To the headquarters of the LSA. LSA? The Lost Souls Alliance. We're a small group, Manuel. We're always looking for new soldiers. To do what exactly? We need help in our intelligence unit. You know Eva, of course. Manny? I was once a Reaper like yourself, Manuel. But I uncovered a web of corruption in our beloved Department of Death. I have reason to believe that the Bureau of Acquisitions is cheating the very souls it was chartered to serve. I think someone is robbing these poor, naive souls of their rightful destinies, leaving them no option but to march on a treacherous trail of tears, unprotected and alone, like babies, Manuel, like babies. What's your evidence? That's where you come in, Manuel. Or should I call you Agent Calavera? Manny suits me fine. I'm not looking to join any military organization, Sal. I just want my job back so I can work off my time and get out of this dump. Well. You won't even be able to get out of this city without my help. Which means, of course, you won't be able to find that woman and you'll never get your job back. When you're ready to join the cause, Manuel, come talk to me. We might be of some use to each other. So you're not really a secretary. I'm a spy, Manny. Well, that's the last time we use that temp agency. Any messages for me? Yes. Join or die. But I'm already... Again! Eva, you gotta get me out of town. They're gonna sprout me. You can't leave, Manny. We need access to the DOD computer network if we're ever gonna find out what's going on. And we can't access without a salesman like you. The computer IDs you when you log on. How does it do that? Fingerprints? I don't have any. Your teeth, Manny. Haven't you ever noticed your computer scanning your teeth when you 